The objectives of this video are to use the TI graphing calculator to find the critical value and test value for a t-test for a mean. In a previous video, we conducted a hypothesis test about whether or not the mean body temperature in adults is actually 98.6 degrees Fahrenheit. There were 130 subjects in the random sample. The test was conducted at a 0.05 level of significance. The critical values were found using a t-table. We have 129 degrees of freedom. But since the table does not contain an entry for 129 degrees of freedom, the next smallest tabulated value of 100 degrees of freedom was used. This row and the two-tailed 0.05 level of significance column meet at the t-critical value of 1.984. Notice the two-tailed graph at the bottom that shows how the level of significance is split into the two tails of the hypothesized distribution. Since we are working with a level of significance of 0.05, each tail would contain 0.025 of the distribution. We can find the critical values using the TI graphing calculator by pressing second VARS. We are going to use the inverse t function, so we will press 4. The area refers to the accumulated area in the tail of the distribution. That will be the 0.025 that we saw in the graph below the t-table. We determined that we have 129 degrees of freedom. Highlight paste and press enter. If you are using a TI calculator that does not present the prompts for the area and degrees of freedom, then you will need to enter the values in the correct order of area, a comma, and then the number of degrees of freedom. Press enter, and the left tail critical value of negative 1.979 is then calculated. The discrepancy between this critical value and the value we found using the t-table is due to the lack of the exact number of 129 degrees of freedom in the table. The hypotheses for the two-tailed test were null hypothesis mu equal to 98.6 and alternative hypothesis mu not equal to 98.6. We can use these hypotheses and the sample statistics given in the problem to find the test value using the TI graphing calculator. We will press STAT, cursor over to tests. We are conducting a t-test, so we should press 2. We do not have the 130 individual data values in a list, so we will highlight STATS and press ENTER. The hypothesized mean is 98.6. So we'll cursor down to where we enter the hypothesized mean and enter 98.6. The sample mean was 98.25. Cursor down and enter the sample standard deviation of 0.73. Cursor down to the sample size and enter 130. The next line requires us to indicate whether the test is a two-tailed test a left-tailed test, or a right-tailed test. This is a two-tailed test. So we will highlight the inequality symbol and press Enter. Cursor down to calculate and press Enter. The calculator then gives us the t-test value of negative 5.47. In this video, we learned how to use the TI graphing calculator to find the critical value and test value for a t-test for a mean.